Hello and welcome to week 97. As you can see, I actually look presentable today. I had a Zoom call for work, so I actually did my makeup, put, did my hair, put on a shirt, <laughs> but still leggings underneath. So it's basically the mullet of outfits, business on the top and party on the bottom. <laughs> so as predicted, um, I did have a pretty carb heavy weekend last weekend <laughs> for Labor Day weekend when I went to visit my friends, um, but it was so worth it. Uh, they made homemade naan and it was so good. Um, they also made macaroni and cheese and that was so good. So my portions were obviously still small, but um, I was not um, like as cautious <laughs> as I normally would be. Um, but I also still did yoga every day, uh, so still continuing the streak there. So for my stats this week, week 97, I am up one pound from last week. Um, so, you know, actions have consequences, <laughs> but thankfully still in Wonderland. So my highest weight was 320. My surgery weight was 297 and my current weight is 198.2. So that brings my loss to 121.8 pounds for my highest, 98.8 pounds in surgery, and like I said, one pound up from last week. <laughs> so yeah, week 97, I'm getting close to week 100 and I'm trying to decide if I want to continue doing weekly videos. Um, I'm obviously not anywhere near my goal, but you know, I just don't, ha other than like reciting stats, <laughs> um, there's really not that much there. Um, so I don't know. I know not that many people watch this, um, but leave a comment if you find weekly updates helpful. Um, the only reason why I think they might still be helpful is because I'm not at my goal yet. And I know for me, I like seeing people, especially before I had surgery, seeing the weekly updates um, rather than someone just going from, you know, I've reached this goal and now I disappeared and now I have regained and come back and that sort of thing. Um, because it's also helpful to see, you know, being a couple or I guess like a month and a half from being two years out to see what loss is, is like um, from that, you know, period of time. Um, because it obviously does slow down and for the example of this week does go up sometimes. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I don't know. Um, part of it is not having that much to say. Um, you know, it's small numbers. <laughs> Um, so not like totally not doing updates, maybe doing like a, a monthly update instead. Um, but yeah, I, you know, I compartmentalize my life so much that I don't really talk about much <laughs> beyond, beyond that. And it's kind of weird. I know there are, um, people that I know that watch and I just, you know, I don't know. I kind of like watch what I say. Um, so you know, just one of those things. I don't know. And I guess week 100 <laughs> sounds like a good week, to, a good time to stop doing weeklies and maybe doing a monthly or, or something like that. Or I don't know, maybe stopping altogether. Um, before the craziness of 2020, a friend and I came up with a list of 20 goals to do for 2020. And one of them was to make a weekly update every week. So that's kind of one thing in the back of my head, like then I wouldn't be reaching that goal. Um, there are certainly other goals on the list that I will not reach, um, but that's one I can help. Um, so really that's, that's kind of like my biggest reason for continuing to do it. It's just that it was a goal that I set for myself that I want to finish. Um, and then also, like I said, you know, providing, um, you know, a weekly update for someone that hasn't reach my goal or reach their goal for like this period of time 
um, which is going on two years. I assume probably by, because I want to lose um, probably 40 to 50 more pounds. Um, so I would think by the end of year three, I would probably, hopefully be close to that. I don't know. I mean this week, or this year, I think I've lost around 20 pounds, I don't know. Um, yeah, so I don't know, we'll see. Let me know what you think. Is it not helpful to have a week just because the numbers don't change that much or would you rather have like a month? <laughs> All right, that's it for this week. A gain of one pound. Um, hopefully next week that one pound will be gone because I will be nonless. <laughs> And, uh, you know, I won't say back on track because I've been back on track, like, since I got back on Monday night. So, I'm not worried about it. But I say that every time I have a game. And it's worked out. So, I guess as long as it's not a couple weeks in a row, um, I don't worry about it. Which is kind of like in the plus column for a week. A weekly video. <laughs> to see like just for myself, um, that it's not gonna be a four pound a week, some weeks. <laughs> All right, that's it for week 97, bye.